Well, hello, my beautiful bitches. It's your girl, Ginger Fahrenheit here, and I didn't take off my drag just so I could say hey. It's been a while. You know how it goes. Busy and shit. But I haven't forgotten about you. Just been busy and shit. Doing a lot of shows. Um, I'm excited because in June, I am... I just did my first of six shows for this month. That's crazy to me. I mean, thinking about this time last year, I was just starting out learning makeup, and now I'm doing six shows in a month. So that's exciting. You know, I feel like that's a big step. But I thought I would do a Becoming Ginger, because I haven't done it in for friggin' ever. And the topic in my brain lately has been... When do you transition from being a baby booger ass queen to like an up and coming queen? I feel like I'm either on the cusp of this happening or it's already happened and I just didn't realize it. Um, it's one of those things like do you consider be being an up and coming queen once you've won your first competition? Is it when you feel like your face isn't ridiculous anymore <laughs> you know is it when you feel like you've got better hair like when's the moment that you stop being a booger and start being not a professional obviously I still have a lot of shit that I need to fix like these fucking eyebrows I need to learn how to draw better lips are a problem for me and keeping my 301s from sagging like Gia guns I have those issues, obviously, and you know, I still have costuming issues, I still don't walk in heels, so I definitely am not a professional, I get that, but where's the transition between booger mess and up and coming? And have I, have I gotten there yet? I mean, I have a reason to believe that I've gotten there, but... I still see so much that I have to improve on too. So it's really hard for me to kind of figure that out. And I wonder if other people that are learning the trade like I am, if they have the same problems. So why don't we have a discussion in the in the post down below. Just comment and give your two cents on when do you become an up and coming queen? When do you surpass that booger stage? Hopefully, I'll start being able to, you know, chime in every once in a while, um, since I will be in drag a little more often now, um, and hopefully we'll revive this page a little bit. Love you all so very, very much. Bye!